Well, I came out here to uh, check out Bailey Lake. And uh, looks like the gate's closed. Uh, closure part of the effort to halt the spread of coronavirus. Uh, looks like I'm hiking in. Hey everyone, how's it going? Well, the gate was closed, so I'm hiking into Bailey Lake. See if there's any tracks along the lake. Uh, so I got about, I don't know, maybe about a mile to hike to the lake. Not too bad. Keep looking all around me. <laughs> uh, this is definitely uh, cougar country. And uh, a lot of black bear in this area, so got my bear spray, got a handgun, so should be okay. I was hoping to be able to drive all the way up to the lake just in case there was tracks I could cast them. My car is loaded up with plaster mix and water, but uh, I really didn't want to pack all that extra weight with me all the way to the lake if there's nothing there. With my luck, there'll be something there and I won't have my plastic stuff. Well, I'm just now hitting Potter's Pond, so I'll get back to you when I get down to the lake. Not sure how the audio is gonna come out. It's pretty windy out here. But one nice thing about this virus, and it's probably the only positive thing I can say about it, is it sh it's pretty much shut down so much stuff. Since this lake is now, and several others just like it, are uh, completely locked down, which means, you know, no boating, no fishing, no hunting, no camping and people just can't access these areas very well. And with the stay at home orders, not that many people are getting out. Which means if there's tracks out there by the lake, the chances of it being another person just walking around barefoot, especially in this time of season right now, the chances of that are probably pretty slim. So hopefully there's something down there worth reporting on. Here's Bailey Lake. Water's up pretty high, I haven't seen it this high for a while. Not sure how much shoreline we're gonna have to walk around on. Won't know until we get down there. Well, no muddy uh, shoreline. A little disappointing. Sure is beautiful here though. Well, I spent about an hour walking around looking for any uh, possible tracks. Uh, there's just no muddy shoreline at all. Um, just saw basic tracks, deer, coyote, geese. So I'm going to head back. Luckily, I know a few guys who uh, frequent this area quite often. They get out here more, more than I do. So they're always nice enough to uh, send me some feedback. 
to let me know if anything's happening out here. So I'll leave it in their good hands until fall. And that's when I'll be back out here uh, checking this area out again. Well, it's a long walk back to the car now. <clears throat> this trip out to Bailey Lake was a bust, but uh, that's how it goes sometimes. Can't get lucky every time. And that's how the majority of uh, Bigfooting is, you know? You never find a thing. One thing I can say that I found out here are a million flies. I mean, look at that. I don't know if you can see that. I mean, they're just latching all over me. The place is just a huge swarm of them. I don't know if it's because I'm wearing something yellow, but I mean, <laughs> they're all over me right now. So if you come out to Bailey Lake, bring lots of bug spray.